I'm going to show you how to add uh, switches to the Leviton scene controller. So here I have three sets of devices. One is the Leviton VRCS4 uh, MRZ. That means it's got a, it's a scene controller with four scenes and it can tr control one load. So I've got it set up already. Uh, previously I showed you how to set this up so that it's it's on the the first switch and then I have a, a GE dimmer switch in the center and I have a GE on off switch on the far right and so the first thing I'm going to do is and I'm using the Vera uh, UI7 with the Vera Edge. I'm going to go in, I'm going to add a scene. I'm going to select my VRCS4. And when the scene is activated, I'm going to put scene, scene 2. And I'm going to set it for the dimmer. So what do you want to have happen? Select device here. I select my GE dimmer. Hit next. And I want it to go on when that scene is activated. I'm going to let it go. It can run in any mode because you can have the Vera set up for like home mode, vacation mode. I don't want to notify anybody. I don't have any special code. Uh, and I'm just going to title this uh, GE Dimmer on and that's it. So once the Vera sets that scene in there. That's all well and good. I'll also want to set up a scene for it to turn it off. So I'm going to do that before I actually show you anything here on the switches. So I'm going to add another scene. I'm going to select the same device, the BRCS4A. When the scene is deactivated, and that's scene two, that's button two, then I'm going to select the device, and that is the GE dimmer, and I want the dimmer to go off. And I'm going to call that. off. And then I finish. Once it's done, I should be able to go over here, turn on the dimmer. What I what it won't do is you know you can't it doesn't set up the associations properly for the uh, the direct associations, but you can turn it on and you can turn it off.